hello guys what's good welcome to another vlog i feel like this is a pretty chilled out vlog and this is just me on my days off chilling around the house doing a bit of organizing spending time with my dog so yeah this is just like a really chilled out vlog if you saw my ikea haul the last video that i did i mentioned in there that i need to just basically like organize my whole house like some of my drawers are like an absolute mess like it's actually a joke how messy my drawers are so i was just like you know what i'm just gonna take like a day off i'm just gonna organize my whole house and hopefully it's gonna be looking super super tidy i do kind of think though i probably need to order a few more organization bits and bobs so we'll see how we get on today but i can always buy more stuff but yeah i watched the i think it's called the home edit on netflix where they were just like organizing people's homes and i was just like i need to do this like i need to organize my home properly because i can't live like this anymore so yeah just a really chilled out spend the day with me vlog so yeah but it's literally like 11 o'clock now and i still haven't had breakfast so i'm gonna make my favorite smoothie i've been having it for like two three weeks now and it's basically frozen mango banana spinach protein powder and oat milk and honestly it is so so good like you have to try it so yes guys literally look how good this looks honestly it tastes incredible like you need to try it it's literally like a milkshake okay guys so i've actually decided that before i start my organizing i'm going to take my dog for another walk and i'm going to take him to the edgebaston reservoir it's like pretty sunny outside so i was like why waste the day so i'm just gonna take him for a little walk. The reservoir in Edgebaston is literally like my place. Like I only discovered it because of the first lockdown and now, I don't know, it's just like such a calming place. Like I went the other day for a run and I literally saw like five swans there. It's just a good vibe, you know? And it's really, really nice in the summer as well. So yeah. Okay, so I'm back from my little walk and I definitely needed that long walk. Like it was just so, so nice and the dog literally loved it. He saw a lot of other dogs. And you know when you can just tell that your dog's smiling, like other dog owners, you'll know what I mean. Like he was fully smiling the whole way around so he literally loved it. But obviously I'm back home now and I'm gonna start organizing my house. Finally, that was like the whole purpose of the vlog, but I just got sidetracked. But yeah, I'm gonna start organizing. So I'm gonna start with the spare room. Okay, so this is the spare room situation. So this is where all of my shoes live at the minute. So I just brought this like shoe holder thing off Amazon. It's very flimsy. As soon as I put it up, it was like literally falling apart. So the plan is to move my trainers onto these shelves up here and then move the perfume onto a different table and yeah i don't think all of my shoes are actually going to fit on the shelves but i will definitely probably be getting another one just to have like a full sneaker wall kind of thing like i've even got these trainers that i haven't taken out of the box yet because they just have no home they just don't so yeah let's organize this Okay, so I'm gonna move all of my perfume onto this little bedside table because this spare bedroom doesn't really need a bedside table. So I'm just gonna put all my perfume on here. Can you believe that like I spilled a reed diffuser on it and then it's kind of like damaged it, mad good. Also, if you're ever wondering and we're gonna buy me a present, this is my favorite perfume. Okay, so in terms of organization, I'm gonna go for like Jordans and Nike on the top. And then I'm just gonna see how I go because I'm looking at these shelves and I'm like, I definitely don't even have room for all of the shoes. So let's see how I get on. Okay, so slightly gutted, but not surprised that all of my trainers and shoes didn't fit onto the wall. But I feel like with these 
shoes down here these aren't the ones that I reach for that often so I'm like they can probably live in my wardrobe um, and then I can throw this shoe rack situation away but I'm definitely gonna get another shelf and then they should I mean I probably need like another two or three um, and then yeah but I'm honestly so happy with it I think you know once I have a few more trainers and a few more shelves it will look so so good so yeah like I said before I went Jordans on this half then the two Nike trainers on this row and then my Yeezys okay so we're gonna tackle my makeup table which I'll be honest obviously I've gotten ready this morning and it is an absolute state but I'm also gonna tackle the drawers as well so I've got these drawer tray organizers and I'm hoping that my makeup can just really fit in somehow some way because yeah this is so embarrassing but this is the current situation so I had these baskets from Primark which I was like oh amazing these will be great but obviously they've ended up getting so dirty they've got makeup all over them and yeah just need to switch up the vibe really so yeah okay so I'm actually super happy with how this has turned out this whole situation is definitely a way better solution to the mess that I had before and then I've just put my makeup brushes in there they really need cleaning but we'll save that for another day and look at my desk yay okay so I'm taking a little break from my home organizing and I've just ordered Nando's on delivery which is going to go down a tree I mean I've barely even done any organizing today but yeah just need some food Okay, so I've had my Nando's now. It was so, so good. Now I'm gonna organize my bedroom. So I'll show you what I've brought. So I've got these like boxes and I'm gonna put these in my divan drawer. That's where all of my like gym leggings and like loungewear is. Um, but I just need to make it way, way more organized. I do think for these little ones, I'm probably gonna like use these for my underwear drawers just so everything's really neat and tidy so yeah okay guys so get ready to see the state of this drawer zero organization anywhere just a whole hot mess so uh yeah i'm gonna sort through this there might be a couple of things that i can take to charity and things like that like i'm actually not too sure what is in this drawer um but i just know that like it's just my gym clothes and like joggers and things like that so i'm gonna organize this now and fold it all up and put it into my little boxes and hopefully it should be looking way way better okay guys so we are done with the drawer it was actually a lot quicker than i thought it would be i thought it was going to take me a while to get through everything and i'm like wow that literally took like 10 minutes why didn't i do this sooner Guys, I honestly thought that organising that drawer was going to take me like an hour at least and it literally took 10 minutes and I'm just like, why didn't I do this sooner? Like honestly, all of this stuff and like all of my little organisation stuff that I brought from Amazon, I've had this stuff for like over two weeks just sitting in my house but I felt so, so unmotivated to like, like even put it out and organise my house and like do anything. Like just literally, I don't know what it is but like recently I've just been feeling like I just can't be bothered to do anything like I just literally haven't been bothered and like even with my channel like I had to take like a few weeks break because I just haven't felt like posting anything like there's no content ideas that I feel like making or anything like that it's just been like a really weird time I don't know if it is because of like lockdown and everything and obviously it's a really like crappy time for everybody but like literally I just haven't even felt to do anything like I felt like I've had like zero ideas about like content that I even want to make and things like that. And also if you're new to my channel then usually I talk about like all things property but I just haven't been feeling to sit and make that type of content at the minute. And part of me also feels like I want to like expand my channel a little bit and have it more of like property and lifestyle instead of like just solidly property especially because we do have like quiet periods where like not much is happening so I feel like I need to kind of like expand my channel a little bit and also I do want to just create like a little bit more like light-hearted content like some of the content that I've made before has been so so heavy 
and like it's so much information to like come and relay like I find it a lot so I just want to switch it up sometimes and have some you know light-hearted chill content just me living my life doing everyday things you know what I mean just more chill vibes I have thought about starting like a weekly vlog where I'm just taking you around with me every day kind of thing just like a little bit more chilled you know not so much high pressure kind of thing but we'll see guys we'll see but yeah like I've literally just been struggling to like feel creative and feel motivated to even create content that is like true to what I actually want to be doing and what I want to be talking about like what I used to do is like ask other people for content ideas and I'd be like hey guys what do you want to see on my channel kind of thing but it's like what do I want to create on my channel like what do I want to talk about what do I want to do kind of thing so the struggle has been real you know the struggle has been real but yeah, I just needed to have like a couple weeks break just to really think about a few things. And yeah, you might see some changes on the channel, but the channel will always be property related because I do love sharing like everything that we're doing in the property world. So yeah, I will always share that, but you know, I might switch up the content sometimes. Okay, so I need to continue with Operation Organise the House and I'm gonna go into the living room now and I'm gonna organise like my cutlery drawers and like, you know when you've got a drawer of like stationery and paperwork and pens and bits and bobs, so that's what we're gonna tackle next. And then we're pretty much done. So yeah, we'll just be chilling after that. Okay guys, so I'm gonna organise these kitchen drawers now. Look at the actual state of them. I mean, where do you even start? Where? So I've got this new cutlery holder, which is actually extendable. So that will fit like the width of my drawers. And then I've got these same little plastic like tray organisers I use for the makeup room. So let's pray that all of my stuff can fit in. We'll see. Well, this is just a million times better already. What the hell? Why didn't I do this before? So I actually took one of the like square acrylic tray things and put it there. So then if I have any like the little bits and bobs that I need to put in, obviously I've got the little space there, but can we just? Okay, so obviously I need to work out where this stuff is gonna go. And obviously I am gonna keep my other cutlery as well. They can go in the drawer. The pink cutlery, I am gonna keep that as well. I'll put it in a bag somewhere. But yeah, I mean, to be fair, I think a lot of this is rubbish. Yeah. Okay, so time for the next drawer. I feel like this drawer is gonna be a little bit more difficult, but we'll see. I've got my like plastic trays and that here ready to try and organize this mess. So let's see how I get on. Oh my God, but first of all, when I got Louis, the breeder gave me this cute little book of like Louis as a baby. So these are all like his little baby pictures and things like that. Like look how little and cute he was. I mean, he's still cute, but yeah. Literally look how much effort they put in to making this little book. So sweet. My little lady. <laughs> anyway. Okay guys, here's the big reveal. Damn. Can we just, can we just? Obviously yes, there is still all of this stuff over here, but it's gonna have to go into a cupboard and then we can organize that another day. Okay guys, so I'm pretty much done for the organization today. I feel like, well, what else is there to do? I'm pretty happy with how my drawers and things like that are looking. So I'm just on Clubhouse at the minute. Somehow I've ended up on a stage talking about love or money. I don't know how I got here, but here I am. So yeah, I'm just gonna chill on Clubhouse for a little bit and then get some dinner later, so yeah. Okay guys, so I'm going to end the vlog here. I'm going to have some chicken wings and some 
Prosecco to end the day. I feel like I've had like a really good day today. Like this has been the most productive day I've had in a while, even though you're probably like, girl, you like literally not even done anything, but it's been good to, you know, organize my house a little bit more. So yeah. So guys, thank you so, so much for watching this vlog. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss anything and give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.